This is version 2, and as you can see, it's much better than version 1 at hiding objects behind it, as it provides a detailed background, the target can get much closer to the material before being detectable, and it's removing both the horizontal and vertical components of the target. I could edit these videos to make this much more impressive than it actually is, as there's a drawback to the cylinder or tightly curved approach in that it only hides the target at specific viewing angles and enlarges the target at equidistant or equal distance viewing angles. If you're a fan of science fiction, you've probably heard the term phase shift. This is where an object such as a spacecraft in phase can be seen and out of phase becomes cloaked or invisible to anyone outside the craft. The fictional part of this is that until now, we didn't actually have that ability. The term phase shift is also used in physics and typically refers to small scale or quantum physics. A phase shift occurs when two identical light waves travel to the same point, but they travel different distances to reach that point. If the light wave started out in phase, they will be out of phase at the destination. If the crest of one wave lines up with the trough of the other, in other words their waves are completely opposite to each other, then they cancel both waves out. This is known as destructive interference. While the term phase shifting seems appropriate for this effect, scientifically that's not what's occurring here. The laser is demonstrating what's happening to the light rays through the double-sided lens. When the target is out of phase, the laser is splitting into two parts, with each laser refracting at 40 degrees, meaning that what you're seeing is the background image 40 degrees to the left and the background image 40 degrees to the right converging to create a neutral zone and the target is invisible. When the laser is within the in-phase section, the two lasers now converge onto the target but magnifying the target size to the viewer. If we know what specific direction the viewer will be at, such as hiding a police officer at the side of the road from oncoming traffic, as the police use their radar or lasers to determine oncoming vehicle speed, as the vehicles get closer past the speed detection area, the angle changes and they see a magnified view of the police officer, allowing for the safety the police require so no vehicle accidentally hits them. Then this could be a reasonable solution to removing the target from view. Within the patent, I've allowed for the manufacture of this material so the majority only shows the out-of-phase sections, and the in-phase sections would be so minimal that the target would be unidentifiable. We could manufacture the material entirely in the out-of-phase viewing angle, but this would reduce the overall detail we currently have with version 2.